What up? Y'all, this next little bit of video, man, that I'm fixing to post up here, it ain't contrary to what some folks might think. It ain't for views, man. It's, it's for my family. If they want to see it, if not, well, then that's fine. Anybody else wants to see it, it's on there. It happened at the ten and a half mile marker. I-70 in Kansas, 26 degrees and snowing, black ice on the roads. This pickup truck pulling this camper had just passed me within probably the last two or three minutes. Nobody was in between us, and there, there really wasn't a lot of traffic out on the highway, to be honest with you. And uh, they lost it, went off the shoulder, laid everything on the left side. So I eased up past the, the wreck, parked on the shoulder, and, you know, beat feet to the wreck and the way the truck was laying kind of down in a in a ditch bank so to speak I was looking at the I think the side or the bottom of the camper no the wheels of the camper was up in the fucking air frame on the pickup truck twisted and the pickup truck was laying on its left side with the damn back wheel of the pickup truck man still spinning that that was wild that shit like I say it just had happened man right in front of me and so how I approached it I was looking at the bottom of the pickup truck and uh, without going up the other side of the ditch bank and crossing all the barbed wire and shit from about 15 foot away give or take a couple feet I hollered, you know, like two or three times, hey, everybody in there all right? Didn't hear nothing. Done it two or three times, didn't hear nothing. So I'm like, oh, fuck. So I beat feet back up the hill to my truck, called 911, and when I first initially went down there, I didn't take my phone. Um, all I had was my little, my little flashlight here, you know, so the second time I went down there, <coughs> I was thinking to myself, I don't know what the fuck I'm going to encounter when I climb up that ditch bank, cross the barbed wire and approach the pickup truck from, you know, the top side of the pickup truck. I'm like, I don't know what the fuck I'm going to encounter. Um, I'm going to record this shit in case I need proof of anything. You know, I don't know. A lot of shit was going through my mind, quite honestly. But um, it was pretty scary for me. I ain't going to lie. It was pretty scary because I had no idea, man, after I called 911 and went back down the hill what I was going to encounter. But thankfully, it was a lady, her daughter, and the dog, and that was all that was in the truck. And thankfully, everybody was all right. I mean, literally, nobody had a scratch. Nobody even had a scratch. So that was a blessing. But here it is if you want to see it. I was using my little flashlight and my light on my fucking camera here. Bad wreck, man. 
We do like to see pictures sometimes. Put on a pickup truck, right in front of me. You can't even really see them. You can't even really oh, see the wreck, man. Really because it's uh, yeah, not miles, but I got it one time. I think it. I hope they're all right. Fuck it. No, that's surprising. Holy shit. <sighs> Anybody in there need a hand or something I can do? That'll just fuck me all up. Yeah, it, that road's slick as shit yeah, out there. Yeah, and then it just, it just... Where's this accident at? Okay, my daughter's in there, and she's right there. Is it? Well, everybody's okay, but... Were you two the only one in there? We're the only two in there, and the dog. Uh, the dog's okay, too? He's okay, he's right there. Oh, Ma'am, dear, can you get out? Yeah, but it's a long drop, hon. Yeah, yeah, it's it is. It's a long drop. I, I just, uh, just fell. Can you get that one? Shit, let me, uh... <sighs> damn, I say I, bu I don't want to bust that windshield. <sighs> let me go over there and see if I can help her out of there. <sighs> but you two were the only ones in there and the dog, and y'all all right. Yes, thank you. Thank God. Uh, it's a no offense, break check, but I think he's probably a little busy. Shit. Yes? Yes. Yeah, that's true. God mean? damn, I can't get up there. I can't. Hey, she made it out. Good job, girl. Oh, you did. Okay. Oh. Saves the day. You all right? Hey. You all right? Y'all all right? I know, I know, all right. I know, I know, I know. All, right. all this saying. shit can be there. repaired. I know, I know, I know. That shit's you know? Fun. Where's the dog at? I hate seeing that stuff firsthand. He's alive, too? Uh, Cut your tongue if you can't save someone. Don't take it personal. Good. I want to eat you alive. Oh, uh, shit. Yeah, get some shoes on. Uh, see my dead buddy. I crawled up. Uh, ran up on the accident. Seen this guy walking around. Did, uh, I got out to help out. I did call. I was like, holy shit, man. Yes, You're lucky to be alive. That's because, a pretty nasty accident. Uh, Guy's like, uh, the same me. I've seen the lights. I'm right over there. You know, yeah. coming up. I'm looking for like, that guy. fuck, that's a car. I said, checked in the vehicle. Nah. Uh, so we ripped open the door and I crawled in. And, he was hanging upside down, down, his neck was broken. Should the dog get out, or you think he's okay? I mean, she's okay, for she's okay, okay for right now. there she'll where she's okay at? Now. Yeah, 4th of July is not the same for me okay. anymore. Oh, my God. Yeah, that's, I mean, I know this sucks. The last thing, man, you gotta you get out here so long, you see shit like that. It fucks with you forever. That's, not, that's why my hats are always off with the first responder, guys. Out of my big Paramedics and cops, so let's get to see that kind of stuff daily. Oh man. Oh, coming down across. Uh, and he's bound outside mobile. He's not trying to build up or shove it to the shoulder. He's not driving on the scene. Looked over. Damn. Oh, I wish I could have tangled up the wires. Oh, uh, y'all, sorry There's about that. I needed my oh, fuck. little tiny oh, flashlight. Yeah, that's a small white sheet. And I needed the damn, uh, the light from my phone. Yeah. I'm going to run well, up here and get him a blanket out of the I tried, trail. like, you know, the whole CPR and all that stuff. Cold. The guy was, like, so smashed in the back uh, of the trailer that he's in, like, fucking a roads are black guys. And his head, how far he got, like, pushed in there. And I felt bad because the first response. Yeah, like, could you give a fuck? I was so pissed more than, like, sad, you know? Because I was like, human beings suck ass. 
And these were grown ass men. It wasn't like he was like teenagers. Fucking idiots. Y'all girls want this one? I mean, it's, it's only one, but it's big. Y'all both put it around you. Well, the guy that was uh, sleeping on the off-ramp, I guarantee this company is going to get sued. Because a lot of states are against, it's against the law for you to sleep oh, on the on-ramp or off-ramp. Yeah, I don't know, because it was one of the... <sighs> What's that wife? Ugh. Broke my heart. Poor guy. Poor wife. Yeah, I, I mean the truck ain't leaking gas, it ain't smoking. I just let her stay in there maybe till they pull it over. Bless her heart, she's probably scared shitless. You know, he talks he talk about these truck drivers, you know. Okay, baby. Working, you know, only can drive 11 hours a day or working 14 hours. But here you got some of these four wheelers, you know, they'll pull a double and fucking drive home tired. Yep. Exactly. I mean, yeah, you got fucking uh, officers, cops. Well, fucking pull their normal shift and or the and the workers a security. So, pineapple. Was that decision of pineapple and pizza? And their uh, hard is a Christmas movie. They're good. They're good. Still ain't nobody stopped out here. <laughs> Cause hell, you couldn't see them. That shit went off the road right in front of me. That's probably the only way I'd have known it. They good, mama and a dog and a daughter. So I just let them keep my damn blanket. And I'm gonna get my ass on down the road. It's slick, motherfuckers. Slicker now, shit. Come in. This has been a paid presentation by NFG Productions. No fucks given. Misfit, I seen you block me or timed out at you put me in the corner, Misfit. You put me in the corner with my plum pie in your live feed while ago. Fucking. I'm your life. I'm the one who took you there. Yeah. I'm your life, and I no longer care.